And there's another thing I wanted to ask you about, Mr. Neil deGrasse Tyson. Will we ever, in your honest opinion, will we ever invent teleportation? We already have teleportation. It's called vehicles. Wait, 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 what? If you break down the concept of what teleportation actually is, you would see just by us being able to traverse from point A to point B with our own modern vehicles, we are already teleporting. It's just not as quick and fancy as you see on Star Trek, but we are technically teleporting. Um, Mr. Tyson, I, I don't think you, you know what? You're the astrophysicist, whatever. Um, how about superpowers? Will we ever, as humans, create superpowers or develop superpowers? We already have powers. It's called evolution. Oh, geez. Um, if you break down the concept of what superpowers actually are, it's just a matter of wanting evolution. We can do things now that our early fish ancestors couldn't do, what they would consider to be superpowers. We can walk, jump, run, throw, and traverse through a three-dimensional plane. Wait, fish can traverse through three dimensions? Mr. Tyson, no disrespect, but those are not superpowers. I mean like super strength and flight. We already have the ability of flight. It's I swear to God, if you say something about an airplane traversing through the fucking sky, I'm gonna lose it. We must activate our inner chi, and only then we can manipulate the quantum flight molecules that have been sitting dormant within ourselves for millions of years to attain flight. Allow me to demonstrate. What the hell? Oh my god, you're, you're actually flying! Oh my god! We already have a god! It is 